I am Lucas Silvera here with Dragon Et. Where'd you guys get your name? Um, I, I thought I made it up out of thin air, but I, apparently I didn't because it's like a, a very um, desirable aquarium fish. Interesting. Do you guys live in bowls? <laughs> Kinda. Uh, <laughs> right yeah, now. Yeah, we no. do. It's called a Dodge minivan or a very small hotel room. You have this huge queer following. What do you think it is about your band that attracts that? If, if I were to take a stab at this answer, lyrically what I try to, what I write about and what I like to sing about are is a, an alternate view of uh, people and personalities and femininity Sex. and <laughs> sexuality yeah, totally. and, and and I think that maybe that is something that is attractive to um, the queer world. And I do think that like Martina's presentation of like sexuality for example is we always use the example of like the Beyonce and uh, what was her name? The um, uh, uh, Beyonce, Beyonce, what was that video? And Shakira. And, Shakira yeah. and the two of them like covered in oil like getting rained on and writhing and whatever and like it, when it's so overt, when that's the sexuality that is so overtly presented with this song like if you're not into th that kind of like presentation of women or that kind of sex there's not a lot left in that song. If you guys are going to work with anybody, uh, who would you guys want to work with? Um, I, I, I want to work with Santa Gold. You just changed her name to Santee Gold, I yeah, believe. Santa, yeah, Santa Gold. Yeah. She's another person that's just like so out, like making amazing, catchy music um, outside of the normal pop world. Like there's no, there's, there's just nothing else like what she's putting out stylistically, like fashion and her voice and her lyrics and everything. It's just like I want, I want to know her. All right, we're wrapping it up here with Dragonette in Toronto.